It's just starting now. Yeah. Hello. Jullie mogen niet duiken met je hoofd naar beneden. Ik weet niet, we weten nog niet of de tenten worden gegeven. Kijk eens hier, waarom ik nou? Jij wil ik hier uit. Oh, je gaat wel koren. Ja, kom. Stop filming. I'm not filming you, darling. Good. As you can see, some people try to do nothing. <laughs> the tents. Hey, where are the kids gone to? <laughs> Run, Damien. There's Boris, there's Aitan, with Yvonne in the middle. Hmm. <laughs> Stevie, you just make a wonderful picture. Rick's making an announcement. Let's just walk up this group. And now. Let's just walk up this group. Willem. Lazy bombs. And the rest outside the girls' wing, that's a little bit of a. Hey, come here, hey!
Je komt op de film hoor. Ja, kijk hier. Ja, toen ben ik. Tony heeft gepusht de, de, ba- de bathroom. Ja. Oh, wow. Hij staat er wel bij het veld. Dat is een nice one, hè? Mm-hmm. Wat is een red light over there? Which one? On the other side. You're right. Yeah. yeah. The battery's working. Ik ging zingen spijt. Zeg het Madagaskar. Het gast helemaal van de spijt. Good thing that yeah, Good morning. It's ten past ten and a new bunch of little animals has arrived. <laughs> so let's go and watch. The day is June the fifth, nineteen ninety-five, Wednesday. And there are games uh, here the students do as well with entertainment. What kind of games uh, are we doing, Steve? Yeah, all kinds of different games. Like a skippy ball race, really interesting game. And uh, well, I don't know how to call these games. Give me a sample, Flores. Please show us how to do it. Yeah, Flores, you show us. Here. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect example. Okay, Ernest. Ernest doing some variation. <laughs> Wow, what fun we gotta have. Mijn <laughs> Oh, I'm cold. He knows that. Hey Robert, did you see that? What? There's someone in the pool. In the pool? Yeah. Who's that? Yeah, a few girls. Let's go and watch. Okay. So uh, tell me, who's that in the pool? Well, uh, now we're recording for cram session, and uh, <laughs> <laughs> I now think Flores is going to. Mrs. Breitfeld, what do you think? Well, I don't know. Mm-hmm. I have to see her body. And Lethal her injection. <laughs> <laughs> the penetrator. Okay, now we hope she's coming out the pool. <laughs> Let's zoom she's in. Not. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Let's forget about the refugee children. Let's stay here. <laughs> <laughs> 
Deze wil ik daar hebben. Roos bij. Roosbeen. Oh, en ik ben Bij die groep. En volgens mij hebben we ze. Oké, okay, dit is een van de meest belangrijkste activiteiten. Het is de Ben Hur Race. Ja. Oké, okay, en we hebben weer twee blokkers in view. Michiel en die zon. En de commentaar is die. Oh, dat valt hier bij een commentaar te geven. The kids are enjoying it. You can read it off their faces. Well done, well done indeed. <laughs> Goodbye. Damien is really enjoying it. Oh, stop it. Damien leeft zich compleet in op deze missie. Zo so aboord en eten. Ja. De competitie verloopt goed. Dat is een goede Heel goed, kom maar. Damien is echt aan het helpen hoor. I think it's clear nobody is doing it according to the rules, but it doesn't matter, it's just for the fun. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> it seems they lost all their coordination sense. Yeah. 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 En dat hebben we onze wow. lijster uh, de vluchtelingen. Nee, lachen jongens. Oh ja, lachen. Ja, ja. leuk. Ja. Even inzoomen. Ja. Ja. Oh. ja. Janine is nu explaining uh, the meaning of this game. Um, do you understand the rules, uh, Robert? Well, not exactly. Her, uh, Me neither. So her way, her way of this... this uh, what's I know? Let's wait and watch what's the meaning of this game. The way of explaining this means much too different. Michiel is making me appear to the show, man. Niet? This is working out quite nice, eh, Robert? Yes. Ja, hou je vast, hè? Ja, hou je vast. Ik ga het niet kwijt, hoor. Ja, hè?
Iedereen. Goed zo, hè? Goed zo. Kijk nou die vogeltjes. Ja, Twee je Today you look like her, huh? <laughs> yes, today you look like Jan. Oh, okay. It's because of the pet. You have a store, do you know that? Yeah. Oh! Yeah?
be working there. Shall I tell you about briefly about the school? Oh, yes, please. Well, we're an international school, and we have students here from all around the world. Even from New York? Yes, from New York. We have, we have a mixture of cosmopolitan. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But we're an international school here, and we have students here from all over the world. Really? How nice. It will be good for my son's education. Yeah, we have a fine mixture of cosmopolitan students here, from Havana to Hong Kong. School. Oh, yes, please. Well, we're an international school and we have students here from all around the world. Even from New York? Yes, even from New York. We have a fine mixture of cosmopolitan students here, from Havana to Hong Kong. Oh, how nice. It will be very good for my son's education. Well, first, we train people, uh, pupils here academic, academically so, they can, so when they leave here, they can go to any university in the world. Oh, how fantastic. And then we train them socially so they can mix with any kind of the best of people. Wonderful, wonderful. Oh, how fantastic. But we, on, we don't only train them academically, but also socially, so they can mix with the best of people. That's wonderful. Stick. But we, on, we don't only train them academically, but also socially, so when they leave here, they can mix with the best of people. That's wonderful. But of course, we don't neglect the physical development development of our students. We have highly skilled... <laughs> oh, wonderful! But of course, we don't neglect the physical development of our pupils. We have highly skilled sports personnel, as well as high-class sports facilities. Oh, wonderful! But of course, we don't neglect the physical development of our pupils. We have highly skilled sport personnel, as well as high-class sports facilities, from tennis to tinderwinks. That's super! There are also extracurricular activities, to name the best, theatre and video. See, we educate the whole person. Oh, goody! Now that I've told just about everything, do you or your son have anything to ask? Well, Socrates, dear? Yeah. yeah. Do you or your son have anything to ask? Well, Soc, dear, is there anything you'd like to say? 
I told you just about everything. Do you or your son have any questions you want to ask? Well, Sock, dear, have you anything to say? Well, I remember. I, I told you just about everything about the school. Do you or your son have anything you would like to ask? Well, Sock, dear, have you anything to say? No. No. As a matter of fact, no, I don't. Other approaches till 10 o'clock in the morning every day in this school. Why not? Well, uh, no. Mom, don't you. I thought you knew that I couldn't do without my poacher. Well, as a matter of fact, no, there is something. Do you have poachers in the school? Well, as a matter of fact, there is one thing. What? Well, well. Mm -hmm. do you have poachers in the school at 10 o'clock? Every morning. Well, um, to be brief, no. Mom, I thought you knew that I couldn't do that my poacher. Didn't you know that? In that case, Mr. Grosfeld, I'm afraid my son won't be attending your fantastic school after all. Sorry to waste your time.
and then maybe you can tell me a small story, or maybe you can sing a song for Sinterklaas. Oh, the first two I would like to see. I forgot my glasses. Can you what's what's written there? Oh, it's this is er, Ernest. Uh -huh. Ernest and 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 Valia. <laughs>
Sharon and Lauren are familiar names. <laughs> These names he checked at the Olympiad game. Although he is amazing at all these things, there are some sports at which he really stinks. For example, the sport golf. That is a problem he will never be able to solve. Basketball is a problematic sport. His feet are simply too big for the court. <laughs> the game tennis he still can't play because of his famous hammers are in the way. <laughs> now talking about ping pong, he couldn't even beat Dora Kong. <laughs> Let's not even talk about badminton. He couldn't, uh, in this sport he got beaten by Cora Kong. <laughs> Since he's so good at men's air, he needs opera singing, triangle playing, and chick checking. His understanding for the fact that losing is also pop possible is lacking. His frustrations are released in statements such as these. Come up, Emil, you can it, Bill. Of the art for now, it's on the stove. He cried out. He out. A cloud of smoke came out of the ears of this wonderful bloke. His negative points of view at school makes this guy so incredibly cool. So let's all try to be like an all around sport sportsman, because deep in our ha hearts, we're all an Emil fan. Because your problems are going to be much bigger. <laughs> he doesn't care 
about others, but about his burden. While he once saw snow from behind a curtain. <laughs> no, he ain't no gentleman, just as everybody not says. He can better be a lady and wear a pink dress. <laughs> Speaking about ladies, he likes to disappoint them by breaking their hearts and saying he doesn't love them. Oh. That only, the only one that he can love is himself. Uh, Here's something to adore yourself. Love. This most repulsive thing sucks on everything. If you put a glass near him, it would fill him to it would fill to the rim with slime in no time. <laughs> and came out of sweater would soon be wetter than after a douse with a fire hose. For it would be quicker devoured in an instant of being warm. Since and Pete were not at ease when we told him of your disease, to our satisfaction they went over to action and discussing it at tea. Pete said, I have an idea. This poor little boy, we will give a toy and surprise from a surprise from Sint and me. <laughs> you see, it's a sucking device, and now that and won't that be nice? You can now slobber and slime everywhere, all the time, on your canal stock, and not, for example, on your sweater, shoe, jeans, and shirt, underwear, or sock. <laughs> Santa Claus. Santa Claus. How are you? Good to meet you. Good of you to come. You go first. Thank you. I'm an old man. Where's my song? Take 
a peek. <laughs> this week, two big roommates have corvée. They would appreciate if you if you change the system before yesterday. <laughs> your stay at Erda has improved your sentence structure. None of the word, none of your sentences end with the word yeah. Ya. Oh, oh yeah. Ya. Oh, yeah. Ya. <laughs> In the morning meeting, the students already know if visitors are coming or if you have to go. Or if you have to go. <laughs> this is shown in the way you dress. You're either in proper attire or you're in a mess. <laughs> I am proud of my age. I am happy. 
I have had so much experience with children of my life, and now 430. Thank you very much for visiting our house. Thank you for waiting for me. Thank you. What? Oh! I was so excited. I broke it. Ik denk, laten jullie maar lekker wachten. Zo, dat is ook helemaal niet obvious. Je komt ook helemaal niet obvious. Hallo? Ik wil dat het schoentje gehoord en mijn laatje. Dank je Sinterklaas. Oh, nee! Heel erg Heel Oké, dit is fijn. Al die girls, ik heb het niet meer gezegd. Peppermint voor je badpraat. Ik heb wel niks van je gezegd. Kijk, hoe is Ligt aan, ligt aan. Let's go. Good morning! It's in the plaats in Twata Peak. Good morning! How are you today? Good morning! Uh oh, my beard is stuck. It's beer. Ah, ah, ah. Good morning! You want to have some cookies? Good morning! <laughs> Good morning, aren't you happy to see me? Mwah, yes, you're so happy to see me. Oh no. Oh no, oh, no my, my nose is white. I should like to How play that my nose. Today? No. Should I ask you now if you want to Because it's too early to wake up. Okay, okay. folding it. Good morning! Good morning! Good morning! Good morning! How Good are morning! You doing? It's center class in Fuerta P. Aren't you happy to see us? Aren't you happy to see us? Eh? Yes, yes, yes. Are you yes. happy to see us? Yes. Yes. Ah. You want to sing I a song for so. center class? Yes, mm. please. Sing a song for center class. Oh, I love songs. Come on, Michael van Gelderen, hey? Sing a song for Sinterklaas. Come on, talk. Sing a song. Wait, I have an idea, I have an idea. Sinterklaas, come on. Boma. Okay. Yeah. I am too. <coughs> now, do you know what you're doing? Do know you know a class? song? Change in the class a no. song. Come on. That's Change in the class a song. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Come on. oh, wait a minute. I know this race. This is the Naughty Boy. Oh. 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 He's a Naughty Boy. Now you better get better before Tuesday because you'll be in big trouble. And to be not naughty, you have to immigrate, you fool. Good morning! Good morning! Good morning, Casper. How's life going? How are you? Good morning! I'm so happy to see you! I'm so happy to see you too, G. Yes, I'm so happy! I'm, I want to give you a kiss. Come on. Come on! I love you! I love you! Oh, I... Louder. If you... Louder. This most repulsive thing 
sucks on everything. If you put a glass near him, it would fill him to it would fill to the rim with slime in no time. And came out of sweater would soon be wetter than after a douse with a fire hose. For it would be quicker devoured in an instant of being worn. Since and Pete were not at ease when we told him of your disease, to our satisfaction, they went over to action and discussing it at tea. Pete said, I have an idea. This poor little boy, we will give a toy and surprise from a surprise from Sint and me. <laughs> you see, it's a sucking device, and now that and won't that be nice? You can now slobber and slime everywhere all the time on your canal stock, and not, for example, on your sweater, shoe, jeans, and shirt, underwear, or sock. <laughs> Santa Claus. Santa Claus. How are you? Nice to meet you. Good of you to come. You go first. Thank you. I'm an old man. Where's my song? you dress. 
you're either in proper attire or you're in a mess. <laughs> Oh, yes, I'm 
come for me. Please. I came all the way from Spain. Okay, and then to class for Queen Jago, but it is Queen Jago, but I'm a Nash, and I'm just a Okay, it is time. <laughs> <laughs> All these girls are getting me very excited. Peppermint for your bad breath. Thank you. Lift on, lift on. Let's go. Good morning. It's in the plus and twat the peak. Good morning. How are you today? Good morning! Uh oh, my beard is stuck. It's beer. Ah, ah, ah. Good morning! You want to have some cookies? Good morning! <laughs> Good morning! Aren't you happy to see me? Mwah, yes, mm. you're so happy to see me. Oh no! Oh. <laughs> no oh no, my, my nose is white. I should like to How are you my nose. today? No. Look, I think I'll have to go to school. Because it's too early to wake up. Okay, okay. open it. Good morning! Good morning! Good morning. Oh, That's in the class and so at the peak. Do you want to have some cookies? Yes. How are hey, you this morning? Hey, have some cookies! Hey! Oh, we are My little boy! boy. <laughs> I love this boy! This is my friend! Oh, hey. yeah. I love you! Huh? Okay, next. Good morning! Good morning! How Good morning! morning. It's center class in Swarta P! Aren't you happy to see us? Aren't you happy to see us? Hey, yes, yes, Are yes. you happy to see us? Yes. You want to sing a I song for so. Sinterklaas? Yes, mm. please. Sing a song for Sinterklaas. Oh, I love songs. Come on, Michael uh. van Gelderen, hey? Sing a song for Sinterklaas. Come on, talk. Sing a song. Wait, I have an idea, I have an idea. Mm. Sinterklaas, come on. Boma. 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 Okay. Yeah. I am too. <coughs> now, do you know what you're Do you know, you know a class? song? Change in the class a no. song. Come on. That's Change in the class a song. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Come on. oh, wait a minute. I know this race. This is the naughty boy. Oh. 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 He's a naughty boy. Now you better get better before Tuesday because you'll be in big trouble. And to be not naughty, you have to immigrate, you fool. Good morning! Good morning! Good morning, Casper. How's life? Good How are you? Good morning! Great. I'm so happy to Thanks. see you! I'm so happy to see you too, G. Yes, I'm so happy! I'm, I want to give you a kiss. Come on. <laughs> Come on! I love you! I love you! Oh, I Friday, 28th of April. Mm -hmm. The construction of the road, Opshawan. Okay. It used to be a mess full of holes. Yeah, now it's supposed to be a proper road. What speed bumps over there? Uh, hello, Bupert. Yeah, hello. No. This is the speed bump. Yes? For people like Flores' father, who drive here 180 kilometers per hour. And for Frank. Oh.
he has been able to find a balance. And all the subjects he did here at Eerde, he passed. And I think that's a great achievement. It has been difficult, but you can see what you can reach with hard work. So I want to congratulate you very much. summarize it of course a lot of things happened we started on the poor hire we had to do a lot of written work for it but it didn't work out that well when i put it in the press he threw all the work book papers in the mold and <laughs> finally he changed to subsit and was able to convince the examiner with a very good philosophy and got well. he passed with a five I amazed all the students because nobody understood this work the examiner did. <laughs> I think you developed in 
And I think the most important thing is that you start really feeling good about yourself. At least that's the way I... Um, not only that you worked very hard, especially the last year, but I think you developed social skills in a way that you admire. I think you really have very good developed social skills. Now in The Hague, the nice thing is that friends may visit you anytime. There's no mom to tell you who has to visit you, when, where, and why not. Uh, there are no ear to, there's no ear to set rules, you can set your own rules, and uh, no disappointments because of certain subjects, maybe. And the last thing is, I am really glad, and I hope you're with me, that you did your extended essay on the Simpson Bay Lagoon, because it might have antique value. Yeah, I think so. Lots of luck. I love you. And since you weren't here, when we had this other thing, I want to hand something to you. I wish you all the luck because it's all that you give you. from where you move into a new direction, Mr. Bracewell just mentioned it. And now I don't think we, we have to worry about you because uh, I think a, a member of the Planica family we don't have to worry because uh, <laughs> we know you as an, a very energetic young man who takes who always takes initiative. Uh, so I'm sure uh, you made up your mind. You made up your mind already, I know. Uh, because uh, this year it is going to be somewhere in a beautiful ski resort in, in France. <laughs> um, he will, uh, he will, of course, study French. Uh, next to that, he's trying to find a, a job. But what makes me really jealous, of course, is that he spends a lot of time in the snow. So maybe I should join you, Casper. But <laughs> I think that would give too much hassle. So I'll come to visit you. Um, now, after, after this year, I, I'm sure this will be successful after this year. You already know what, you, what you're going for next year. You will be in, uh, studying in Delft. That's correct. Um, we will really miss you, your your plantegraan enthusiasm and your initiative and all your your joy. Uh, I wish you all the best in the future. And congratulations. Um, which was, by the way, her lowest mark on 
only one. He wrote a letter to the IB, and the IB granted her permission to go for the complete IB diploma. Because the IB says if you go for certificates, you only go for certificates if you want to go for the diploma, you have to follow a different line. But she wrote a letter, I wrote a letter, and it was granted. Marissa had a very heavy workload because it meant CAS in one year. It meant um, TOK in one year. It meant extended essay in one year. And I say in one year, but actually it has only been half a year because the deadlines were before the written exam. At times, it was almost too heavy, the workload, I think. But perseverance can bring you far and you persevere. <coughs> you also had an additional problem, history. <coughs> Marissa had started the course History of Americas in Ecuador. We teach History of Europe, which meant, again, a burden on your own small shoulders. Strong shoulders. And also that went well. I can go on. There were some more, let's say, bad luck moments. Right? You know what I'm talking about. Yeah. But we also overcame that. And I think it's a real accomplishment that you passed your IB diploma, most of it in one year, with 32 points. Not everybody can do that. Switched on the battery, and from that moment you were, and you worked really hard. 
art. And uh, what you achieved, uh, I have a word for it, and it's not my word, it is a word uh, written down by the IIB on a feedback forum for extended essays, and it stated that Erich Brahms' extended essay was excellent. And I think that is exactly the word for your achievement, not only for your, for your extended essay, but for your achievement altogether. Spanner in the works. Uh, I don't have, I have one serious thing to say about Denise. Uh, that is, um, she always had the capacity to keep asking questions. Um, and if you don't know something, it's a very good idea to ask questions. I, I'm very shy about asking questions myself. So. But um, that's, that's the serious part. So, uh, but the, uh, maybe the other part is more worrying because I, summar I summed up the flippant part uh, because we have a relationship going way back and in a little poem. So it won't take very long. So. <laughs> Denise Barr. The time has come, Denise, when I must tell the truth, the bare and the embarrassing, the inexorable truth. A shy and introverted girl with corrugated hair, an L.A. Frisco accent, and at times a deadly stare. <laughs> she felt at ease, I do believe. In any situation, she sure did know of letting go. She had a reputation. And in my class, it came to pass, at least on one occasion, she gave a lesson to us all in female flatulation. I don't know, you don't know what happened. <laughs> she liked sorry for the first. She liked to play the helpless role to get the help she needed. She's proved her method to be right. She's here, she has succeeded. is not always to the swiftest nor the battle to the strongest. And um, as a result, Marinka approached studies, CAS, TOK, extended essay with the same amount of dedication and enthusiasm. And I think all around is a very hard working young woman. <coughs> She's also, I think, possibly the only student last year who realized the full enormity of the idea and just how big the whole thing is with your six subjects and your TOK and extended essay and all that sort of stuff. And I think sometimes it was a bit too much for Marinka, but she always picked herself up and threw herself at it again and again, just like she's doing now, because you're picking yourself up and throwing yourself at it again. And Marinka's a perfect example of the old saying in English, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, 
some guests have not arrived yet, or they must be standing where I can't see them. That's Ralph, <coughs> and David. Well, she is coming, and we will save that for later. Great. Well, as I said uh, earlier tonight, uh, it is going to be extremely uh, warm in this room, but it is also going to be extremely pleasant. We have heard uh, an, an enormous variety of uh, support and, and, and love for uh, the students we are going to miss in the future. Um, this graduation ceremony will now close with uh, beautiful piano um, music to Juliet. Uh, so we'll all enjoy that for a few minutes. <coughs> Thereafter, you're free to go. And I suggest you go to the main hall or the staff room where um, uh, there are some delights. Uh, meanwhile, I would like to ask the uh, <coughs> graduates to stay behind because they still have to perform one or two acts. Yeah? <coughs> of course, they are to leave us a few messages in the famous book, and there's all phrase one page for each year. <coughs> and if you want to take some good photographs of uh, the graduates, uh, but I'm sure yeah, we can handle that on our own. So I suggest we now listen to <coughs> Thank uh you. -huh. 